This video intended for educational purposes. Hey guys, it's Anime K Swimming Bird, and welcome to the 1.6.2 pre release for Friday, July 5th. You can even see a little guy swimming down there if you look hard enough. Uh, that's one of the fixes today that you're going to see. Man, they're going crazy. Okay, so uh, <laughs> today we've got about 30 or so bug fixes, and a lot of them are pretty central to stuff that people have been complaining about since 1.6.1 came out, and I'm going to go through those real quick. Now, the first one down here, we've got a few baby horses, some foals hanging around. Well, uh, they can no longer be pushed, at least that i found, pushed into blocks and suffocated. They will kind of at least stop they have more of a solid model where they won't go into them and suffocate which is awesome so don't worry about your horses and your baby horses suffocating they should be okay now um, the biggest uh, glitch that a lot of people are complaining about is that when you would load a chunk your animals and your fences would break out or they would uh, suffocate in blocks but no longer that should be fixed now and another fix that was uh, preventing people from using older maps in 1.6 was that nether fortresses wouldn't spawn enemies like blazes and wither skeletons in them if it was an old map but now that has been fixed so you can still use your old maps in 1.6 and don't have to worry about that uh, some other funny bugs if you were to hit a wolf uh, with like a projectile uh, a wild wolf with a projectile like an arrow a snowball or a potion it would cause uh, nearby tamed wolves to attack their owners, so you could get your friends killed. If you're still playing on a 1.6.1 server, you could still do that. It might be hard to set up, but it could be pretty funny to hit a wild wolf with a projectile and have your friend's wolves all turn on them. Um, you didn't hear from me. Now, uh, another glitch that I, I messed around with and showed you in other uh, pre-releases was if you were on a horse or a minecart uh, and you're riding it and you logged out and logged back in, your horse would move very shaky when in F5, but that has been fixed as well. Uh, so some of the other things, uh, w the one that I just hinted at was pretty, oh, before we get that, this is actually a pretty significant one. When you craft your hay bales using your nine wheat, you can now break them back down and get your nine wheat back, which is awesome. Hay bales are still very expensive. I wish they would only use four wheat to make them, but that's some wishful thinking. But it still is nice that you can get your wheat back for them, finally. Uh, but another one that I was going to mention, that you saw that baby zombie run over and get killed. Well, here's a little clip uh, showing when you uh, are clicking your spawn eggs, there is now a random chance, uh, it seems to be quite low, that you will spawn a baby zombie. But that chance also exists for uh, pigmen, zombie pigmen, so you can get like a baby zombie pigman, which normally you have to do some finagling to get that into the game. Uh, it's They're real cute, they only have a skull, they don't have any flesh on their head, aww. Uh, <laughs> but anyways, so those can be spawned with eggs now. Which might mean that they could spawn randomly in the world without needing to, you know, have a baby to put them in the world first, which would be pretty awesome. Uh, obviously, they're super fast and dangerous because they uh, they don't burn up and everything, so look out for that. But uh, I thought that was a cool little addition. There was a glitch in 1.6.2 where only the baby zombies seemed to spawn, so I think by fixing that, they might have added that feature in, so that's pretty awesome. Now, uh, ropes being only visible from certain angles, that's been fixed. They should, the, uh, the leads basically, should be able to be seen from lots of different angles. Uh, some other stuff, there was that glitch with the uh, breaking sounds where you could, uh, I can't, lead, I could lead this guy and throw it on here. With the, uh, the breaking sounds with water, like you would try to put water into a source block of water and it would make like a sound, it's same with lava. It would make a weird sound, and it would not, you know, it would make particles fly out, but that has been fixed, so it's not going to be weird anymore. And probably the most, uh, the most wanted fix out of all this since 1.6 came out, sprinting no longer requires the server to, uh, to initiate. That was a bug, and it doesn't have a delay when you start, so you can sprint right away. They fixed that. We were fearful that that was because of the new attribute system, but it was a bug. It wasn't intended. So you don't have to worry about that. And that means uh, riding horses should be a little easier now, too, and maybe not as delayed, hopefully. So that is pretty much it. There's a lot more bug fixes. Uh, mostly not as important stuff, but still good for fixing in the game, obviously, to make the game work a bit better in 1.6.2. So because this is a pre-release, we'll probably get the full one next Friday. Uh, but 
look forward to that because these are some major bugs that they're fixing here and they fixed them really quickly after <laughs> the release. I'm, I'm glad that Dinnerbone and Jeb are on their toes and Grum as well. So uh, thanks for watching guys and uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this. I'll see you next time for more Minecraft. Goodbye.